today I'll be making paneer masala, which is the most common dish we order in the restaurant. I'll try to make it as close as possible to the restaurant recipes. Let's try it out. The ingredients are chopped onion, chopped tomatoes, paneer, which I've already diced in cubes, crushed garlic, crushed ginger, fenugreek leaves, some cream, little honey. For the spices, I'll be using turmeric powder, cumin powder, coriander powder, chili powder, salt to taste, one bay leaf, cinnamon stick, green cardamom, soft or fennel seeds, some peppercorns, cloves, and oil for frying paneer. Let's start with deep frying the paneer. Turn them occasionally. We'll fry them till they become light brown in color. Paneer is light brown in color. I'll take it out and put it in the warm water. Keep paneer aside and now back to the stove. Pan is already hot at medium high heat. Add oil to it. Add whole spices, bay leaf, cinnamon stick, green cardamom, cloves, peppercorns, and fennel seeds. Stir it for a few seconds. Add crushed garlic, crushed ginger. Mix it for a few seconds. Add chopped onions. Mix it and cook it till onion becomes soft and change the color. It might take 7 to 8 minutes to, for the onions to become soft. It's almost 7 minutes. Onion has become soft and they change the color. It's time to add the spices. I'll add turmeric powder, coriander powder, red chili powder, cumin powder. Mix it well. Add chopped tomatoes and cook it at least for 7 to 8 minutes again. Stir it occasionally and cook it till tomatoes become little soft. In between, add salt to it. Tomatoes have become soft. I'll switch off the stove. Let it cool down for some time. Put it in the blender and blend it to a thick gravy. Before blending, take out the cinnamon stick and bay leaf. Blend it to a smooth paste. If it's too thick, add a little warm water while blending. Pour the mixture again in the pan. The gravy is now hot. I'll add almost half cup of water in the mixture. Mix it well. Cover it and cook it on the sim for at least 20 minutes. Gravy might stick to the bottom. Stir it occasionally. It's almost 20 minutes. Let's see how the gravy looks. Looks great. And now add crushed fenugreek leaves to it. Mix it well, add little honey, and now add the paneer, mix well and let it cook for at least 5 minutes. It's almost 5 minutes. Switch off the stove. 
add cream to the gravy. Mix well. Put it away from the stove. Paneer masala is ready to serve. It looks so good, so awesome. Mm, it smells so good. I'm sure you're going to like it. Try it at home. Let me know how it comes out. Thanks for watching. See you next time.